plasma is the fourth state of matter. It's, a, it's very, very hot. It operates at 30,000 degrees temperature. The sun's a plasma ball, lightning's a plasma. And what we like, what we use it for is we take it and we, we use it in our processes. We transform waste to energy, uh, wire to powders for 3D printing. So our core business, we use it in processes that destroy waste on board the U.S. aircraft carrier. We also use it to destroy chemical warfare weapons for the U.S. and U.K. special operations groups. We also use it in mining metallurgy to either recover waste or transform a product from one form to another, like quartz to silicon metal to be used in, in solar panels. And out of manufacturing, we many years ago uh, uh, invented a process called plasma atomization, which converts a wire into small spherical powders. Over the past several years, we gave the rights to someone to use it. It became the uh, gold standard uh, in the industry for uh, titanium powders used in metal printers. The first quarter was, was really interesting. We, it was the first time we were cash flow positive from an EBITDA adjusted basis. Our revenues were up 67% or so Q1 over year over year. Our gross margin was over 50%. We have cash on hand of $1.3 million. Our backlog is an astounding $9.4 million which taking the context of uh, our previous year's hist uh, uh, revenues of five, five to six million dollars is rather substantial. The majority of the companies we deal with are, are credit worthy companies like the US military, special operations groups, but most of our projects, in fact, I think all of our projects are cash flow positive from the outset. Uh, we don't need working capital to make ends meet on a project basis. However, we never had enough projects to make the company cash flow positive overall. But as you can tell from our recent backlog and, um, and recent numbers, we seem to be crossing that boundary. There's consolidation taking place within the industry. End users are buying um, printer companies and powder, powder producing companies. So there's a lack of powder producing companies um, in, the, uh, in the industry. Uh, we promised to come on stream uh, Q1 making powders. We did that. But there's a, a ramp up of four to six months. During that ramp up, we did not expect, as one might not ex expect, um, anyone ordering samples because the type of powder we have now may not be what we have at the end. But with two orders for sample powders, I think it underscores uh, in the industry the interest in our powder and the confidence that we're going to have quality powders at the end of the day.